Hi, this is Rip with IMSI Design, and today I'm going to put a window inside a door. So we're just going to have a simple profile inside a door so we have glass in the door. I'm going to start out by going to creating a new document from the architectural template. I choose the architectural template because the uh, styles and the walls and the doors are all uh, already preset to realistic uh, sizes. So then I want to get my tools that I'm going to use for this exercise. I'm going to go to Tools Customize. I'm going to need the Style Manager palette under Palettes. And Toolbars, I'm going to need the Architecture Toolbar. I'm going to go ahead and dock this toolbar right above the drawing area. And I'm going to start with the Profile Styles. So I'm going to want to create a new style. Now be careful because if this button is depressed, the Delay Style Modification, you cannot create a new Profile Style. So I'm going to create create new profile style. I'm going to enter a unique name. And then I need to draw a boundary and a hole profile. So starting off with the boundary, it should be the same size as your door. So in that case in this case, I'm going to have a three foot wide and it's going to be six feet eight inches high. Okay, and now I'm going to want to draw the hole, which will be 24 inches wide, 36 inches high. Now to center this, uh, the hole in the boundary, I'm going to, hmm, something happened where my uh, hole just disappeared. It's strange. Anyway, so let's go, I'm going to do 24, 36 inches. I must have not hit the correct button to finish it before. There, now I've got it. I want to move it around. I hit the D key on the keyboard to move the uh, reference point. Hit M for middle snap. Snap middle of this line, the middle of this line. Then I want to move it six inches down. So in the delta Y field, minus six inches. Now I need to use these two uh, icons on the architectural toolbar. It's edit boundary profiles and edit hole profiles. So first I'm going to select the boundary, hit the finish flag, next hit the hole, then hit the check mark. Now you see if I've done everything right, I've got the blue boundary on the outside and the red hole on the inside and I'm ready to apply this to a door style. So first I'm going to go ahead and draw a wall to put the door in. I'm going to go to door styles, go to single, go up to profile and choose the uh, profile I just the profile style I just created. Then I'm also going to want to go to the uh, change the material just so I can uh, see it. Now I'm going to go ahead, drop the door in the wall. Let's change to a different view. Now I'm going to go to a rendered view, and you can see that we have a the glass in the door. Turn off the grid so it looks a little bit better. See, so that was fairly simple.